Guys, let's start with Valencia. Uh, what have you made of them this season? Well, I think so far it's been, it's been great. I think something that we've been looking for in the last two, three years. Um, it looked very promising this, this summer when they started with a new project, a new manager, when it seemed that uh, finally everything was working in one direction with one idea. I think it helped not only the players in the club, but also the fans to understand where the club was were aiming. And although I don't think anyone was thinking of Champions League, the way it's turned up that the team is performing very well and, and Champions League now, it's an option. I think actually it should be an obligation for the team not to lose that, that chance and the opportunity to be there and, you know, build, build up from the, for the next coming years. What's been the biggest change and what's been the driving factor to the success this season? I think it's the fact, like I said, that, that there was a project. There was, they, they, they got uh, a sporting director, they got um, a manager, both together worked in a way, obviously the manager wanted to play, to go out there and get their players for the system. Uh, the only thing I'd say, I might say is a lot of them are on loan, so when it comes to the end of the season, they, they need to change that. But um, for this season, everything was planned. Everything was, was, was with an idea. And, and football, normally, when you work that way, um, things go, go well. And that that's was, I think, my, the key for me, for Valencia, to actually find, find this, this success. Great news, of course, from Valencia this week from UA for the fact that the top four places in La Liga mm -hmm. will automatically get a Champions League place. What would Champions League qualification mean to that football club at this time? Well, I think it would be amazing, not only financially, but I think also in the way a lot of these players are on loan because uh, the Valencia situation was, uh, will be, will be <clears throat> uh, an extra, an extra uh, thing to for these players to stay because we'll offer them the opportunity to play in Champions League and, and also because they will see a club that is ambitious, that, are, that is a club that he was wanting to, to compete and to, and to win trophies. So it means everything also for the club, for the fans, the prestige to be playing in, in the Champions League, to see again in the Mestalla the biggest clubs in the world. I think, I think it's, it will be the great news that the Valencia will have in a long time. How far do Valencia look at the table? What is achievable in the remaining games this campaign? I think they are taking the, the, the popular game by game. I think uh, they, they don't even think about the end of the season being in, in the Champions League or not. I think they are taking every game <clears throat> as it comes, uh, trying to perform and to win every single game as it comes. Knowing that, you know, it's up to them to, to reach that objective. And, and I think being realistic, is an objective that, that, is, that is likely to, to hopefully happen.